3 a.m. A calm night is broken as Rescue Engine 12 6 of the Christiana Fire Company in Newcastle County, Delaware responds to the report of a car on fire at a nearby apartment complex. Arriving on scene and positioning the front of the rescue engine for proper hose line deployment, the crew finds a sedan with fire showing from its engine and passenger compartments. Firefighter Josh Hawk single-handedly deploys the front bumper line, while firefighter Don Moorhead quickly switches the rescue engine from driving mode into pump mode, allowing the hose to be charged with water immediately. This fire will be fought with only the water stored in the onboard tank. Josh begins suppressing the fire from a downwind position to provide exposure protection from heat radiating from the vehicle, a preventative measure to avoid igniting the surroundings, including an occupied apartment building. A leak allows the remaining tire to deflate safely. A tire burning through and blowing out during an involved car fire is often a sudden, explosive reaction which can send sharp debris flying at anyone nearby. As Josh dons his personal protective equipment, or PPE, he is constantly watching for changes in conditions and assessing the fire's behavior. As Josh puts water on the fire in the engine compartment, its magnesium components react violently with the water, producing a blinding white light. Even after the fire appears to be extinguished, a risk of additional flare-ups remains. About 3 o'clock in the morning, we're alerted to a car fire in the Village of Kent Apartments. We arrived. Found a mid-sized BMW, pretty well involved with fire. So we stretched the front bumper, it's three-quarter line, extinguished it. Doesn't seem to be any extension, uh, no injuries at this time, and the fire marshal is going to come out and investigate.